hello beautiful people my name is wilma welcome to my youtube channel i film weekly content relating to faith and waiting motherhood lifestyle marriage and all the good stuff if any of these contents relates to you hit the subscribe button and turn on your notifications so that when i upload new videos you will be notified so in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you especially if you are watching me and you are waiting for a particular season of god to manifest or for a particular season in your life to come i'm here to tell you that have fun have fun that time will come and more importantly if you are waiting for a baby i'm here to tell you that have fun baby will come let's take a breather we will be right back to start the video okay so welcome back let's just delve right into the so, video as i mentioned in today's video we are going to talk about having fun we are going to you know discuss the importance of enjoying all these blessings god has given us whilst we wait for our turn to come with respect to whatever season we find ourselves in you know on this channel i really talk about issues relating to conception trying to conceive or infertility so um this video is really targeted at couples trying to conceive let me just put that out there now every information in this video is my personal opinion um and uh, some of the videos you would see are my own um um or let me say my based on my opinion all right so before you attack me <laughs> So this is where I continue from last week. Okay, so with all that being said, there are two activities you can do. Indoor activities to have fun and outdoor activities to have fun. Some of the indoor activities to have fun with your spouse are just basically hobbies that you enjoy doing. You could enjoy baking, just bake together. You could enjoy cooking, cook together. You could have some games in Ghana, in Africa. We have local games like Oware, like Ludo, like the drafts and all those things. Just, just have fun, bond together. Now the internet, the phone has taken the place of some of these activities that we used to do communally to bond us. But sometimes put the phone away and have fun, proper game, interpersonal fun. If you decide to watch even a movie or be on your phone together, then it should be something that is bringing the two of you together, like movies on Netflix, okay? Like um, games on the internet that you are playing together, things like that. So don't don't neglect that opportunity to just bond over those games that you can have at home or outside the home. Now, even indoors, you could have your own swimming pool. Now there are floatable no um how do you call it inflatable pools that you can even set up at home okay to just have fun and just swim at home if you don't live probably in a compound house or in a communal house you have your own um yard you are in an estate or you're in your own house things like that just take the time to just have fun by swimming and yeah things like that okay now let's go to the outdoor activity one of the activities i love is being at the beach my brethren watching me there is something at the beach that i cannot explain for as long as i remember i have been at the beach almost every season of difficulty of my life and i have sought answers from the lord and i have received them one of the activities that i've been able to constantly do at the beach has been to just um write or journal things like that at the beach it's so exhilarating walk at the beach take long walks and you know just have fun at the beach hey yeah so i'm at the beach this is the first time after so many years that i've actually come to the beach and i'm just walking along the beach line or along the coastline barefooted actually so you can see my 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 legs are barefooted. I'm just having an alone time with God. So yeah. 
Sometimes it's necessary. These loan works are important for clarity and things like that. Yeah. So, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> you can also journal here at the beach. You can just take walks. You can journal. You can pray. You know, you can just commune with God on a more deeper level. That I've done that for years, and it's always very good. Hope you enjoyed the video once again. Recently, we took the opportunity to go to Ocean Beach in Crown Crown. Now, listen, Crown Crown has some of the nicest beaches you can think of if you are living in Ghana or Accra, to be precise. And we went to the Ocean Beach. I'll insert some of the videos so you see it was. It was a great place to be for the weekend to just um, do some scouting, okay, for a program we are just about having. If you are waiting and you are watching me, look out on the My Faith My Womb show on Facebook. There's an upcoming weekend getaway that you even don't want to miss. That's precisely why I'm even doing this video. So, yes, be looking out for that. And we had so much fun. We had so much fun at prom prom you know it was just relaxing it was just a day but it was so refreshing and the food was good you would see some food we ate banku and salad like that we had seafood i love love the seafood they did and we also had family time swimming in the pool you see us swimming in the pool Her baby was having a lot of fun and i i shared that you see it was just the two of us would have just had fun and we're having that. fun yes but we couldn't devote time to ourselves really because all the attention was on baby for baby to have fun whilst we also support him having fun <laughs> Yes, that's the reality, my darling. What another me. activity you can do is to go for hiking. Yes, go for hiking, go to um Cape Coast, Kakum. You can just hike in the forest, okay? Just travel, go on road trips. Now, there's this activity I'm dying to see, it's called the zip lining. So, you know, zip lining over, I think, the Volta or something. Now, you can check, I'll put these two links in the video. You can check Stella Chanel's link, and you can also check um, Hetty, Henrietta Ajete's link, okay? Henrietta Ajete's link, you'll see that. They do travel vlogs and they show you where to get really nice experiences in Ghana and outside Ghana. So you can follow their channels. Their links are in the description box. Stella Chanel and Henrietta Ajete. So they have documented some of their ziplining experiences. You can check that out Another too. activity is to go for mountain hiking. Go to Shy Hills. Just take a day trip to Shy Hills and just go hiking. You can also do some sightseeing in and around Another Africa. activity to really do after checking out Stella and Hetty's YouTube channel is to plan a day for sightseeing. Now, I know that Henrietta does um, day, you know, sightseeing. She's a tour guide. So if you like to pay for a day sightseeing in Accra, kindly contact Hetty. I'll put her um, description. I mean, it's the same link to her YouTube channel. So you can contact her and arrange for a day tour in Accra. You can also practically go for this amazing activity at Wager Go Kart. Go Karts. Go Karts. You know, so you can just do car racing, things like that. Okay. You can also check out the Accra Zoo. Accra Zoo. And just have a day fun at the Accra Zoo. I'm sure you just have to pay something small and just enjoy the day at the zoo interacting with the animals. I remember um, the name of one of the monkeys I ever visited at the zoo. I think it was Kumasi Zoo. Oh, Mama Lou. <laughs> Mama Lou, you see, I still remember Mama Lou. I've forgotten where she was, whether Accra Zoo or Kumasi, I've forgotten. But yeah, you get the picture go for safari seeing okay there's this beautiful hotel in the upper west royal cozy hills they have the safari with giraffes antelopes i mean you just name it okay so plan a trip there just go for sightseeing you know in the north just en enjoy that safari experience even here you can also check out safari valley resorts this video is not sponsored by any of them but i just i've just looked them out online and i can bet you to have great experiences when you go there so yes i hope these um 
activities I've shared with you are just a brief uh, um, guide for you to have some fun, spice up some, you know, something in your life, spice up your romantic life, you know, as a waiting couple, you know, plan that romantic, you know, boat ride, something, you know, the, the point I'm making is that, hey, you don't need to just pay so much, you don't need to spend so much to have fun, at the same time, you also have to make it a priority to inject some life into your life you understand don't let the situation cripple you cripple your emotions make you down depressed and all that because there is life to live whether you have children or you don't have children you matter people have had children and they die six weeks after two months after eight weeks after five years after they died so what is it if you don't have yours yet it's a good time to live your life so i hope you really enjoyed this video comment in the comment section below other places of interest that a waiting couple can visit now like this video share this video to a waiting couple you know or any other person you know for that matter if you are single waiting for marriage don't wait till you are married to travel travel now start enjoying that experience now so that when you get married it wouldn't be anything new to you you understand so yes turn on your notification button when you subscribe to this channel i don't know what's going on with youtube but please do turn on your notification and let's do this together so till i come your way next time with another video my name is wilma thank you so much for watching this far do subscribe and i will see you in the next video bye bye